Yeah, let's do a bit more of this before I kick back with some starter. But for now. What character was I up to? Oh, ugh. <laughs> this one might be a bit tricky. Okay. Uh, what do I want to do? Just let's just go with the relaxing option. Uh, I need to think how I want to play this. I forgot to read what his passives were. Alright, let's just go Bible, Old Reliable. projectile based. Make sure I got the right one here. Yeah, okay. I want to try going the cats again. Hey, Nick, what's up? How's it going? Pretty good. Gonna have Alaskan fried cod for lunch. <laughs> Damn. I don't know if that's a fish type I can get here. What do you usually have it with? I'm very particular with fish. Like it has to be really good fish. Fires three projectile. What is this bracelet? Fires three projectiles at a random enemy. All right, let's try it. Oh, you can barely see it. The thing some people call chips with fish. Ah, fries. Yeah, yeah. I get it. I mean, for, for us, it's like, because of the British, that's why we call it that. But we also call it potato chips chips as well, but like, there's never any confusion. There it is. And I'll get the duplicator, because everything is projectile based. Uh, base damage by 10%, or... Eh, let's do that.
Uh. Yeah, good. I wonder if this thing evolves or not. I guess we'll find out. I was trying to look up on my phone if it evolves, but I can't do it quick enough. I'll do it in a minute. <laughs> I think otherwise it'll be too obvious what I'm doing. I mean, it doesn't seem amazing, so I'll just do other stuff. Uh, yep, okay. The good old fish and chips, yeah. Um, one of the uh, American people, well, the logical, shared a photo of uh, some fish and chips he had on Discord, and man, I mean, the fish looked good, but the chips, it was like, that's not chips, they're not thick cut enough. And it was such a small portion, I mean, I don't know how it is elsewhere, but in Australia, you just get an insane portion of chips with every serving. And they have this, uh, when you order some, some chips, every fish and chips place has the concept of minimum chips. And you think, oh, the, for the first time you're like, all right, yeah, I don't, I'm not hungry, I'll get some minimum chips, because it's probably a, a small amount. Ah, it's like, I'd say easily 200 grams of fries, if not more, or chips. You must be prepared for how much you eat there. Um, yeah, how's it going? Is it Twitch at? I haven't had proper British fish and chips yet. I, I feel like I have to one day. Just to kind of compare, but it's something that I don't eat often just because of how much a serving is. Like, it's, it's ridiculous. You can't eat a portion of chips from the chippy too much. Yeah, exactly. I have the same problem. Like, if I'm going there, it has to be with people, because I, I cannot... cannot have a portion on my own. But, you know, the thing we do here is we have, uh... chicken salt. Which is put on every single batch, and it's so good. You must have that if you're going to have it. Gotta have that chicken salt. Okay, I might look this up. Uh, what's it called? It's called the bracelet, right? Bracelet... I'll do it, I'll just do it on here. I was trying to do it with one hand, it just doesn't work. <laughs> just looking up stuff. I can't type with one hand. Okay, it does evolve, and it evolves with... Wait, what does it evolve with? One sec. Usually it lists that. It does evolve. Okay, hold up. Oh. I think this one's a weird one. This one just evolves on its own without any input, so that's interesting. That's why I can't find what it evolves with, because it's nothing, it's just on its own. So that's neat. So I got a free slot with this one. But I mean, the two kind of common staples that you can find in takeouts here is like, you have Fish and chips, which is a British thing, and then we have, like, charcoal chicken, which is just, uh, 
Rotisserie chicken over hot coals. And you get chips with it as well. And those are pretty cheap and you get a pretty large quantity of it. So. Surprise, surprise. Can you guess which one I tend to go for? <laughs> that sounds good. Oh, it's great. It's amazing. The chicken? Yep. Yep. But it's it's really good. Yeah, it's the same kind of chips you would get at fish and chips, more or less, but then you have it with chicken. And then some of them will pour like gravy on top. It's it's a great meal. And it's one of the cheaper meals you can get. Sometimes just even getting a whole chicken from them and just kind of taking it for sandwiches or something is also something that's good to do. But yeah, they have different packs. There's like your basic chicken and chips and then they have one that's like chicken, chips and two salads. Again, a lot of food. That's why it makes me happy when I see chicken in this game. I'm glad they don't do the turkey. So, you know, tonight's going to be a late stream. <laughs> I was out, uh, I went to h hang out with my brothers, and my parents are around as well, so, yeah. Hadn't seen them in a while. Went to go see them. Went out for dinner. It's good. Went to a Malaysian restaurant and had some really decent noodles. I mean, their specialty is laksa, but, like, you know... I'm quite a sucker for, like, a plate of good stir-fry noodles. And, uh, yeah, my brother got a new kitten. Oh, so tiny and adorable. Like, you can, you can put him in a shoe. That's how small he is. Kind of climbs perfectly into a shoe. I do have a free one, but I feel like in this case, probably cooldown reduction is the way to go. I'm kind of looking forward to playing starter, because now that I... Outside is taking shape. It's starting to look visually nice, and I have a couple of other ideas I want to try. I also got told of um, some other game on PC that is like... I guess it's kind of in the same vein of Animal Crossing. I haven't quite looked into it. I got the name of it. 
um, written down on my phone somewhere. But it, it does look interesting. Oh, yeah, there it is. I'm not really sure what my last item should be. Oh, you know what? I have an idea. Alright, I, I got it. I got it. I got it. I'll go for four seasons. Because I can get AoE and then I'll get the free um, spinach. I guess this is the first weapon that evolves twice. Uh, let's... Yeah, why not? Just get things to last longer. That Waluigi game I played this morning. It was a lot of fun, but man. <laughs> I got a little bit salty, not gonna lie. And so, you know, so much for not playing games that uh, are difficult. Oh well. Wait, where, where did the bat go? Oh, I don't think it dropped anything. Alright, uh, I'm heading towards... the left piece first. Oh yeah, I see. There's, there's something I overlooked. The sound effects are great. Yeah, look at that. Okay, I'm not missing anything. Okay. 
the, 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 I, I find it strange that it goes from cats to eyes. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I wish it went to... I don't know, like a tiger or something. Instead of a gigantic eyeball. Like, it is, it is a little bit unexpected. I'm really looking forward to next week. <laughs> Not just the fact that it's a three-day work week, which is nice, but also get to play Pizza Tower. I'm kind of, kind of looking forward to that. say how much does this well take okay so now it's the tribe bracelet i don't know i don't see that much of a visual difference it's kind of blending in with the rune tracer as well That's everything, it's just the Bible. This character is slow as well, but it's not as slow as some of the other ones. Okay, see, now I can kind of see. They look a bit like fireworks, almost. I'm not that far away from the luck thing, either. I could probably get it on the way. are truly done for now. Chicken!
You no, know, you know what? That is that is ages away. All right, I'm not gonna get it. I'm just gonna walk towards the destination. Oh boy. Yeah, uh, yeah, this character doesn't have much health. <laughs> That's a good indicator of uh, how much I should avoid stuff. Oh, there we go. Egg done. Thank you. This is what I wanted. Oh, I think I messed up. I picked up left without picking candle up. Ah, look, it's fine. It's still projectile base. It doesn't have to evolve. I forgot to pick up candelabra. It'll still defend me pretty well, I think. I just wanted a fireworks display. I think it'll be fine. Chicken. I still gotta get, uh, the right piece, so... What a total waste. Once I'm there, I'll, I'll pretty much just hang there until the end. Let's just continue with the bracelet. Okay, okay. It's fine. How far away am I? Oh, really? This character moves so slow. Uh, not even halfway. Uh, just get left. Uh, armor. Left. 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 Alright, there we go. 
Since that, that is gonna be my final evolution, that item, so... I'm gonna make it. It's just an eternity away. Honestly, if it wasn't for this laurel. Yeah. Okay, wait for the charge to come back. I left the chest, didn't I? Where? How far back? Oh no, yeah, no. <laughs> this is, that is in the middle. It, that's That's gone. I'm not about to walk in the opposite direction two minutes. I just want to make sure I got the cape, at the very least. Okay, uh, pretty much that, pretty much that. Is that it? I think this is it coming up. Alright, so it's about equal distance to the spinach. Okay, here we go. I'm just gonna walk my way down there now. But slowly. Keep that thing in the radius. Left. Look at all the colors. <laughs> yeah. Fireworks display. Hey, Gammy, how's it going? Long time no see. I also had a dream that I lost my voice overnight because that I was worried about it. Because of yesterday's stream, I just laughed way too much. <laughs> I thought I had woken up and I didn't have a voice. I was like, oh no, I have to cancel the stream.
things are okay. Just want to get this summer uni unit done that finishes next week. Nice. Yeah, get it out of the way. I mean, at the very least, hopefully you still get your uh, long weekend next week. Or is it one of these things where the university and its infinite wisdom is like, yes, let's schedule the end of this on the public holiday. Students like that. Used to get that, uh... I had an exam on Melbourne Cup holiday and it, it sucked. You saw me playing Waluigi and was tempted to type, oh yes, but you were afraid I wouldn't do the voice and it might hurt. Oh no, I did it. I was fine. I did the whole thing. I got tilted a few times, so you know, there was, uh... There was voluntary and then there was the involuntary. Like, I was saying, I was saying it to be funny, but then I was also like using it as a coping mechanism when the game was unfair. Because it was a fan game, right? It's not an official game by any means, so it does have issues around balancing. So, it, it uh, yeah, it got to me a couple times. Not gonna lie. It looked tricky. Um, it, well, it, the sta it was the stage that was the problem. I think there was just too much going on, and the boss just had too much stuff. But I got there in the end. The game is fun, and it's an interesting concept. But uh, there were parts of it that are definitely unfair. But I think I'm halfway through it. It's not a very long game, so I'll do the other half next weekend. You know, I did the whole nasally while Luigi thing. I was like, oh, yeah, yeah. You'll be back for starters, just junk on the screen. Oh no, this is the end of this. This is how Vampire Survivors is at the half hour mark. How am I still alive though? How, how am I still alive? <laughs> this thing usually murders you instantly. I'm kind of surprised I'm surviving. As the name would imply, I guess. Upgraded Laurel, no kidding. Okay, I think I need to be strategic about this. Always for chicken. It caps all damage done to you at 10. Ah. There's an achievement to survive 40 minutes. I could probably do it with this build, right? Oh no, there's two of them now. <laughs> Game is pissed. Surely one of them's gonna die soon, right? No, I mean, I didn't bother getting the clock, because I was like, nah. It's not necessary. Admittedly, I may have given up, uh... Oh, wow, I got it. I can't believe that. Okay, well, now this is definitely the end. No, leave me alone.
Yeah, I mean, I ha I think I have. Oh wait, what did I do that for? It's instant. Um, I have survived like five minutes after the time ends, but that was on a fifteen-minute stage. I know how to do it. I just I haven't been bothered. All right, who's next? Uh, yeah, yeah, this just looks like the same character, just slightly different. All right, this this has piqued my curiosity. What does it mean? By at least they're lucky. Do they have no health? Is is that the joke? I don't I don't want to find out. Like that description is vague enough that it's got me worried. Okay, no, it's fine. Ah, twin birds, please. Uh, yeah, I, I kind of have to go garlic on this one. I need something defending my character immediately. Uh, I didn't mind the bracelet. The bracelet was kind of decent. And it's one of these items where I can just get whatever I want. I don't mind that. It grew on me a little. Slot. Okay, there we go. Twin birds are active. Maybe I could do like a really expensive build. <laughs> Would be funny. I'll do the most expensive build I can think of. Twin birds, twin guns, and four seasons. Then I can focus more on the passives more than anything else. So like, cooldown reduction, orb, uh, duration. This build is super good because you get two more free spots, yeah. That's pretty much the idea. The only thing is you would have to get crown. To ensure that you level up. In a good manner as well. So I'm gonna make sure that that happens. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna try and get crowned now. Because it, it's crucial to this. I don't want to spread myself too thin yet. I want to make the bird strong and then start building into it. Although maybe I have to. It looks like I'm having trouble. I thought the band would be enough to kind of keep me afloat, but I don't know. Ooh, this character does not have health.
Help, 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 come on. What happened to at least this character's lucky, huh? Crown, there we go. Alright, crown secured. get garlic increase just so they can't get that close to me hopefully first gun. Just kind of help a little bit. It's a little sketchy, but I think I'll get that. I need to start getting more of my passives. Okay, nice. Particularly cooldown reduction, that'd be a good one to get now. I can probably evolve the bracelet. Uh, crown. I'm just worried. <laughs> I don't know what. The 10 minute mark is going to be the test. believe in this build. Oh, orb, 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 orb. Get the orb. Okay, got it. Uh, I guess. Alright. Okay, I'm saving that orb for later. I'm gonna stick around here. Just get a bunch of stuff killed and then go collect the orb. I'm being very greedy with these chests.
Okay, getting the chicken. I can last a little longer. Not yet. <laughs> Maybe now. Okay, now. Uh. Oh, uh, this is kind of annoying. Uh. Alright, get the second gun. Oh no, I'm dead. It's okay, revive. That was a little annoying. I really wanted to evolve the rubber band, the, the band, the bracelet thing. I call it a rubber band because it looks like those rubber band bracelets. I don't know if you have them. I'm sure you do. They're pretty universal. Like, charities use them all the time. You purchase them for like two dollars and then it goes towards the cause. That sucks that I lost a life because that, that just means my guns are not going to be as strong later. It's these bats, they're way too tanky. Alright, I'm going to have to go through this. That's something I can get behind. Okay, we can pick up a chest. Finally. Didn't give it. Okay, try again. Just going for it. All right, cool. There's the upgrade. It's a bit early to get that. I'm not going to get it yet. Good. Twin birds are almost done. go for the chest now. Uh, just here. Okay. <laughs> I'm a ghost? Yeah, this character's a ghost. Kind of reminds me of, um, 
the ghost from Pokemon Red and Blue. The one that ends up being uh, Marowak. Anyone? I think I'm having movement speed problems, so I might just get this. Things are catching up to me too quickly. I have freedom to pick passives, so... Oh, jeez. I'm not sure I'm going to survive here. Ugh, these whales are too strong. Alright, didn't work. <laughs> Build failure. Ugh. I mean, I think it's a good idea. It's just, I don't, I don't think I got things in the correct order. Alright, I'm going to try again. I want different music. This one. Vaguely familiar, it's been 20 years. Yeah, I mean, you go to Lavender Town, and it has that creepy music. And you need the, uh... The special scope to be able to see its true identity. There was always that really weird, um... I mean, I don't know... If this was universal, but... There was the urban legend that, um... Like, Cubone is just a, a Kangaskhan whose mother died, and then wears the skull of the mother. Did anyone else heal that one? Like, there was so much of this Pokemon, um, just, I guess, urban legends that used to go around. And, you know, no internet, really. So you couldn't really debunk them easily. It was just, like, playground talk. Oh, I may have ruined this already. I need something to defend myself. What am I going to defend myself with? Screw it. Blue, red, and yellow were among the last games to be in the urban legend sweet spot. The internet existed enough to spread them, but wasn't prevalent enough to debunk them. Yeah, exactly. Plus, you know... The faking was kind of hard to, uh... Point out, since it was... New. Like, the one where Mew was under a random truck. What are you, what are you talking about? Mew was under the random truck the whole time. You just had to hold your Game Boy upside down. The funny thing is, there was a way to acquire Mew with a glitch that people discovered years later, so there was a way to get it. <laughs> and some of them... They had a little bit of truth to it. One of the ones that I definitely fell for, and I'll admit it, um... There was like... You had to beat the Elite for a certain amount of times, I don't remember. But more or less, after... After you've beaten it a certain amount of times... Um, Professor Oak will challenge you to a battle. And you get to fight, like, the, the starter that no one picked. Um, and there was truth to that because there was a fight coded into the game, but it was just never used. So, at, so at some point, I guess maybe they did intend for that to happen. He ended up getting Mew through the missing number exploit. Damn. That's lucky. Am 
Now this one was like very specific. I got it because uh, I did a link, the link cable uh, trick. One of my friends went to the actual physical location you had to go to go get one. And then yeah, just spread it throughout the school. You had to carry a specific number of items after jumping through hoops to set the physical memory. Yeah, but did you know, like, when did you do this? Surely you didn't know that as a kid. <laughs> I mean, everyone knows the explanation now if you look it up. But like, I don't think that was public knowledge back then, at least not when I played it. Like, every single bug in that game just had to do with... There was limited resources, and so certain addresses in memory were just shared, so... You know, things would glitch. And because there used to be... I forgot the total number, but there was more than 150 Pokemon originally, and they just left the slots programmed in. That's why you're able to do it. Like, the entry exists, but there's nothing allocated to it, so you get that weird stuff happening out. It's kind of cool how they've uncovered pretty much every single Pokemon that was intended for the game before they got cut. There were some really interesting ones in there. Like, it, it took decades to do, but they, they got it done. You think you were 13 or 14 back then? Alright. I mean, I think I, I was 8 at the time. And this was like, maybe a year after the game came out? I can't remember. It took a while to get out, to get released in Australia, because, you know, back then it was like, yep, release the game in Japan right away. Then a couple of months later in America, then Europe six months later. And then, maybe, if we're lucky, a year later, Australia. <laughs> Just... We weren't really a territory they took seriously back then. And in some cases, there were some games we just didn't get at all. The game was already five years after release. Yeah, okay. So at that point, they probably knew all the intricacies of it. I played it, uh, you know, during the release period. Um, Gold and Silver wasn't out yet, but it had been announced. Oh, beautiful. All right, that's a good one. But yeah, some of those, uh, urban legends were crazy. And then there was an another wave of it when Gold and Silver was announced, and there were screenshots from Japan, and then people used those screenshots to kind of say, yeah, see, these are special Pokemon you can get in red and blue if you do this, this, and this. It was always funny when you would meet a kid that said they did it and it worked. And then you'd be like, show me. And they'd say something that's like, oh no, I just released it. It wasn't it wasn't good in stats or, or something like that. I'm like, okay, kid. <laughs> the annoying childhood friend, you know. That's one of my favorite memes is the annoying childhood friends. 
We all had that person in our lives growing up. You'd play a game of tag, and whenever you tagged them, they would be like, nah, nah, the game was paused. It's paused. Game was paused. Doesn't count. Excellent. All right. Um, I mean, I'm trying not to get the bracelet. But I, I do need something else to defend myself better. Defend yourself with overwhelming firepower. I mean, I want to get there. But this, this build I am going for is admittedly a little greedy. Um, yeah, let's just get more XP. I've been trying to circle back to this chest, but there's just always something there. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. This is how I got it. Yeah. And a worthy chest it is. Pretty lucky to have gotten it, to be honest. Um... Okay. <laughs> Three items. Yes! Oh, yes! Alright, there we go. Okay, and there's the other gun. All right. Greedy build is greedy. Again! <laughs> ah! Dude. How many, how many is that in a row? That's the third one, right? Like, all my chests practically have been that. Oh, yes! <laughs> all right. Uh, that was the redeem, by the way. Uh, I'm gonna go Bible. I think we definitely need this. Just something to help. <laughs> I've uh I've did something as well because so the head for that emote comes from um the Wario Land manual so there was a scan of it and I just took the head of it and made it into an emote so you know I traced the graphic and uh I may or may not have turned it into a t-shirt that I'm getting for myself <laughs> so yeah no I think it makes it makes a good t-shirt. It would probably make a good poster as well. I mean, my ghost is probably the ghost of the many 
lost souls of Castlevania. Okay, if the birds merge, then I get garlic. That's... The birds have merged, we get garlic. Alright, there we go. Um... Okay, this is good, this is good. I'm gonna get wings, just to, you know, help me out here. It's kind of funny. I think the reason the previous attempt didn't work was because I didn't get passive items to help. Like, it just didn't give me the option, so... I think this is going a lot better because of that. Uh, yeah, we want Spellbinder. Alright, we got, we got all the items. I'm gonna increase pickup radius one more time. Like, these passives are just as important. How far am I? Probably still a while away. Uh, I am gonna get four seasons, so I do want four seasons. There's still a while to go before the pistol evolves, so I might just cave and get it. Uh, I guess I have no choice on that matter. Oh no. Ah, uh, these stupid werewolves are so tanky. This is exactly where it went to crap last time. Man. Okay, I do have another revive, but like it's kind of ruined the gun build. The gun build revive. Okay. Requires revives. Okay. Uh, I'm going to try one more time. I'm going on the belief of the minecart. When in doubt, minecarts. Oh, this ruins me! <laughs> okay, uh... I'm just thinking what's gonna work with minecart here.
Oh, that was bad. Ah. Ugh. This is not a good start. I'm, I might have to just say that this is a bad start to start again. Alright, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> I just, that, that was too much on the back foot already. It's the move speed that's the killer part. And the fact that this bird doesn't really do much. Alright, uh, yep, let's go minecart. It's so specific. <laughs> this is another one of these characters where you have to get movement speed, I feel. Otherwise, you're just gonna have a bad time. Um... All right, I'm trying a new strategy here. I haven't used this in a while. All right, that's a bit better. I'm just gonna forget about the birds. Until later. going to rely on um, life leech. Give me minecart upgrades, what is going on? Too many passives. Dude. Real okay, whip, that'll that'll do. Just That's just so unlucky. I hate it when that happens. Yeah, yeah, keep keep giving you passives. I guess area damage is not too bad. It does help with the whip. Uh come on. This is this is so unlucky. I can't believe how bad this is. Um Okay, duplicator. This helps the cart indirectly and the other stuff. I think it even helps the whip. You get one more attack off it. Well, um, and then I guess the last item in this is a track orb. All right.
I don't know. Ugh, this is annoying me so much. Like, it, it doesn't want to give me the... the cart. I'm just gonna upgrade movement speed. At least this feels more normal now. Just the whip would be nice. Okay, there we go. Uh, I'm gonna keep going with the whip. The whip is close to being upgraded, so. There's not much required for it. Okay. Get a brace off. This is just going to come down to the 12 minute mark again, like what happens at that point when the werewolves are in the picture. I can't just keep getting passives. I have to. I'm going to level up the bird, even though that's not what I want to do. This is, this is struggling. <laughs> I blame all the passives. Look at my levels. It's like, most of my levels are in passives. I just might have to come to terms with this not working out. This is rag likes for you. It's like some days you just have bad runs and you can't do anything about it. believe. 
thanks. I will try my hardest. I mean, at least I think what's keeping me alive right now is honestly the movement speed. It is buying me the space I need. I think with that, I definitely would have lost by now. Okay, there we go. More minecarts. That wasn't much. Eh. Alright, it was, it was a little bit. That's a chest there. Alright, hang on. Whip, thank you. I just had I just had to take items when they're available. I can't hang on to this. Tanky bats. <laughs> well, I mean, I didn't want the bird at max, but I guess here we are. Good. Give me the whip. Thank you. How much is that? Alright, whip is ready to evolve, I think. We'll see. That should help a lot. Alright, that, there we go. There's my game changer. Alright, things might have turned around now. I can't go for twin pistols because I don't. There's no tiramisu on the map, so. We just have to, uh, yeah. Change our perspective now.
Okay, we're up to wells. This is where it usually goes down. Oh wow, that's fortunate. Moving towards the heart. To the cart, stick to the cart. <laughs> Let the cart <laughs> be your way through this storm. Okay, good. Um, knife. No, minecart is definitely like a huge carry here. It still might not be enough. <laughs> the whip is also healing me back up, so that's the other thing. Um, alright, there's bird number two. We're getting second bird. Without this passive heal, I I'd be screwed. Sucks. It's giving me too many passives again. No. Nah. It's okay. Got another life. I was really trying to get garlic here. to kind of help, but this is not working out. Ah, oh, lucky. Nah, I'm dead. Alright, this character is, is tricky. I think the way I'm going to have to play it much like all the other low health characters, um, Rune Tracer is the way to go. And just get early armor. I tried Life Leech, it didn't work. Alright, we'll leave it here for now. I just wanted a somewhat short attempt at some of these new characters. Yeah, I'm gonna take a short two minute break and I'm just gonna get myself a beverage. And then, uh, let's continue starter, yeah? But, uh, first, gotta stretch my legs, so. If you're here for Vampire Survivors or watching this on YouTube later, thanks for watching.